So some people, when they want to use the data and import with Power Query, they come here to file and then they go and do publish to the web. This is not a good solution all the time because if you are publishing to the web, what happens is that you are making the file public and you are allowing browsers to find information and that find that file if people are searching for keywords that are uh, that occur in that file so that may not be what you want if the information is private okay so what we will want to do is to use this share button and i don't i don't need to do that because claudia is the owner of the files and she's the share the link with me and here you are able to say if you want it to, to share this with just spe specific people or whoever gets the link uh, is able to access the file, but the file is not public. It's the same thing as when we are sharing our files with uh, from OneDrive or Dropbox, any other cloud service. We are giving a link to someone, but we are not making the file public. Let's connect to the file. We need the link to the file, right? I'm going to copy the link for store store A. I'm going to copy from here. And let's connect Power Query to this sheet. We go data, get data from other sources and then from web. We need to wait a little bit for Power Query to respond. And the, in the URL, I'm going to copy the link we need to replace, let me bring here my, my sheet sheet so that you see. We need to replace this portion here with this portion here to make it easier to access the data as an Excel file. Okay, so I copy that and I come here, I delete this portion, edit until the end, delete that and paste with export question mark format Excel SS X X. Okay. Let's see if it works. It seems to be working. Okay. So now we have the elements in that sheet as the, as if it was an original Excel file, which is very interesting. We can see here that we have table one, table two, table three. Claudia, did you create these files in Google Sheets or in Excel and then uploaded them? No, they were created in Google Sheets. Okay, but when we convert this with re replacing that little piece of the link, it converts the tables. It shows us the file as if it was an Excel file with the, mm -hmm. it identifies the object table as if it was an Excel table uh, with different names as well. Table one, table yeah. two, table three. Okay. Mm -hmm. And here we have the sheets. Since we only need the data from the tables, we are going to connect to the tables. Okay.